Hey gamers, it's me, Shinobi Nando, and welcome to another What's in the Box! Today we're going to be doing A Little Hope, which is the sequel to Manama Dan, part of the Dark Picture Chronicles. Or Anthology? Sure, it's one of the two. Guys, if you're new to my channel, this is the series where I break down where you can get the cheapest version of the game with the most exclusive goodies, so you can make an informed decision if you're going to pre-order or just buy the game outright. So if you're into good deals or collectibles like I am, consider subscribing. Little Hope is, as I said, the second part of the Dark Picture Anthology, which in the vein of the PlayStation exclusive Until Dawn is kind of like an interactive horror movie. Now, I always thought this series would be really good for some, like, typical Bandai Namco low to mid-tier collector's editions or limited editions, because the crux of this game is basically controlling a character and looking for physical clues, so it's like ripe for replicas. I mean, there's also jump scares, but you know, I don't find them that scary. I mean, I don't really get scared at much, so that's not belittling the game. That's just, that's just me. <laughs> Thanks for that, Chibi Nando. You just had to go and show that clip. Anyways, first up, we have the standard edition. Now the standard edition of the game could be bought from pretty much anywhere, including the Bandai Namco store. Now there's no steelbook with this or any exclusive bonuses at any particular store or retailer. However, if you do pre-order, you will get the curator cut, which like the first game, Manamadan, means you get the alternate take on the story from the get-go. This will be released free for everyone a bit later on. And to be honest, it can technically be accessed if you do play the game co-op. Yes, that's right. These games are cooperative and I highly recommend it. It's really, really fun because your friend can kind of screw you over a lot like Nate B1991 did when we played together on stream. Thanks for ruining our perfect run. Right guys, moving swiftly along, we have the Limited Edition Volume 1. The Limited Edition of the Dark Picture Anthology includes Manamadan and Little Hope. It also includes two exclusive collectible pins, a four-disc steelbook case, and the Dark Picture Anthology World Cloth Map. Now this is pretty cool for one or two reasons. First of all, you get that steelbook that's going to host each of the games so not only do you get two games in this anyways which makes it ridiculously affordable especially if you guys haven't played the first one but want to dive in or try the demo this is a perfect version for you you get both you got to remember that the retail price of little hope is going to be roughly around 24 pounds in my territory and manamadan still sells for about like 10 to 14 unless you get a pre-owned You'll get that exclusive steelbook as well, which will let you store the rest of the anthology all together, kind of like in, you know, those collectors or special edition DVD cases you sometimes get. So it's kind of cool. It kind of vibes again with the whole movie theme that they're going for, the horror movie thing. Well, interactive horror movie. It kind of blurs the line. The badges are a nice touch, and most retailers have this for roughly about £40 to £45, depending where you order from. I found this available on the Bandai Namco store directly, Amazon, Game, and Shop2 here in the UK. You can also get it from GameStop EU. In Australia and New Zealand, you can pick it up from EB Games, and of course, the Bandai Namco store once again. And for people in the United States, this might be a region exclusive edition. I have not found it anywhere. Sorry guys, maybe you guys will get something different. I'll include a link in the description if you do. Lastly, for those of you who are just planning on picking up Little Hope, maybe you've already beaten the game, maybe you got it on Xbox One or PC Game Pass, there is just a collector's edition exclusive to the Bandai Namco store. In the Little Hope collector's edition, you'll get Mary's Ragdoll, which is approximately 15 centimeters, the aforementioned two exclusive collectible pins, You'll get the Steelbook once again, which can hold all four discs from the anthology, and the Dark Pictures Anthology World Cloth Map. Now, I really like these kind of small, low-tier or mid-tier collector's editions that Bandai tend to do a lot. It really reminds me of like when they did the Little Nightmare 6 edition. Just a nice, cheap collector's edition, not too much more than the, the standard edition. For those of you that are perhaps mega fans, but realize that this game would be a bit, you know, overpriced if it had a massive collector's edition, something like Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. I think that more companies should do these mid-tier editions or low-tier editions, as it were, because they're cheap and they help people get into the collecting community. 
This is the one I'll personally be going for, and I'll be sure to unbox it here on the channel. Now comparing the two, one of them you get two games for essentially a slightly cheaper price. You don't get the collectible figurine or doll, but everything else is the same. It's the same steelbook. That for me, that steelbook is kind of a cool thing. It's very unique in the gaming world to have like a multi-disc collector's steelbook. Like I said, very much like the fact that it's based off movies, DVD collector's editions or limited editions tend to do this, where you can display, open it up and display it all. And it seems like a nice homage to that. It's it's bleeding. It, it is an interactive movie. It's a game, but yeah. It, what I'm trying to say is this game blends the lines between movie and game. It is very much a horror story and a horror movie that is interactive and has multiple endings. One of the few games where I felt like my decisions mattered. So definitely consider this one. Let me know if you're picking it up in the comments down below. Give this video a like if you found it helpful. If you didn't know that there was a limited and collector's edition of Little Hope but are a big fan. And don't forget to subscribe for more unboxings, more videos such as my reviews and guides. And even more, what's in the box? I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.